That's good, bro. Oh, oh, yeah. This is crazy, man. You're the goat. You, tell me yeah. to go you watch up my videos? Yeah, all the time. Yeah. Yeah. You walk in, I got butterflies, dude. <laughs> Let's go. John's about to give a speech. They're in there, so I'm about to go in there. Let's go see how he does. Obstacle, you were created to be great. So I want you guys to get this. I believe in you. I believe in each and every one of you from the bottom of my heart. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. So John just finished his speech. Now we're about to, I'm about to head over to the golf field, golf with my homies. And then he has another speech tonight, which is gonna be dope because he's talking to the football team. You guys are gonna love this one if you play football. So stay tuned. My boy. What's up? You want this shirt? Yeah. Filthy. Let's go. Oh, is it on? All right, here, here. Messed them up, bro. <laughs> Dang. Get in the hole. Let's go. There. Let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Hole in one? What? Hey. Hey. You ready, bro? Bro. Yo, so we, hey, look, we gotta hop out of the car, and this team is 502. They start warm-ups at 5.15, right? And so we're not there yet. The coach just called me, so we're literally going to hop out the car and just be ready to be great, man. That's what it is. We dedicate ourselves to this, and so we're ready to be great. And so this team, we're, we're going to tell them to be ready to be great. Yes, no warm-up needed. We ready. No warm-ups. Yeah. When I played on game day, there wasn't much that needed to be said to me because I was just ready to go. And so I know a lot of you guys are ready to go, but if I could just encourage you a little bit, you know, fighter's heart, that's the theme for the year, right? To have a fighter's heart. Man, this week, probably one of the most difficult weeks of my life. Just on Monday, got a call from the doctors and they said your father passed away. But you know what, fellas? Every single day, my dad wanted me to show up. He wanted me to show up and not just show up, he wanted me to show up and be great. So when I talked to Coach Thomas, he said, it's okay to reschedule. I said, there's no way I'm rescheduling tonight. I'm going to be there, and I'm going to go be great. Why? Because I have a fighter's heart. Four quick things I want to share with you guys. Man, first, I believe in you guys. But in order to be great, you first have to start with a great thought. That great thought becomes a great action. Those great actions lead to your purpose. Great thought, great actions, Great habits, great purpose. Great thoughts, great actions, great habits, great purpose. 
In this game, you're going to experience adversity. In this game, you're going to experience life. But this game is, is the best format, it's the best platform to teach you to how to respond to adversity on the outside of the field, outside of the locker room. But it has to start with a great thought. Every single play, you have to think great. And those great thoughts, I promise you, they will turn to great actions. And those great actions will eventually become great habits. And at the end of the season, you're gonna say, you know what, we have the fighter's heart because you realize that you've been walking in your great purpose. Do you guys wanna be great? How many of you guys wanna be great? That's why I'm here right now, because I want to be great, and I want to walk in my great purpose. When I was young, I faced a lot of adversity. Born a drug-addicted womb. My mother used crack cocaine. When I was a kid, I had a speech impediment. So when I take that, I want to be great every time I speak, because when I was a young kid, I could barely speak. When I was young, I couldn't read. But I had big dreams. And so I decided at the age of seven, I'm going to start having great thoughts. Those great thoughts, became great actions. Those actions became great habits, and now I'm walking in my purpose. Everything I ever wanted to do, everything I ever wanted to become, I'm living it right now. Traveling the country, inspiring young people, inspiring athletic teams. Why? Because I had great thoughts. I'm literally a year away from becoming a doctor. Why? Because I had great thoughts. You guys have great goals for your team, great goals for yourself. Start with a great thought, and I promise you, those great thoughts will become great actions. Those great actions will turn into great habits. Those great habits, at the end of the season, you'll say, we walk in our great purpose, a fighter's heart, because we started with that thought. Repeat after me. Great thoughts. Great thoughts. We have to say it like we're getting ready to play in a rivalry game, like we really want to be great. Dig deep. Say it like you're playing for your family. Say it like you're playing with something bigger than yourself. On the way here, I was talking to my boy Ramil. I'm like, man, I'm amazed at how many fans they have. People honking their horns, go, go hornets, everywhere. You're playing for something way bigger than yourself. So say it like you're playing for something way bigger than yourself. Let's try it again. Great thoughts. Great, Great thoughts. There we go. <laughs> Woo! Give us a pass, coach. Yeah. Great thoughts. Great thoughts. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I hope you guys enjoyed that speech. All my athletes out there. I love my best friend, John Gaines. College game day videos, they're dope. Go check out these videos. Start here. So if you want some merch, check it out right here. Also, if you're new, subscribe. You guys subscribe for more videos that come in. Thank you guys for the support. Much love. I'm out.